Captain V103, ATL's number one for hip hop and RB. It's the morning culture. Frank Ski, Jade Nova, JR. The homie is in the studio. King. Yes, young what's King. Up, what's up? Young what's King up? Harris is in the studio. Yeah. You're Good here morning. because you got a you got a song. That's right. I yes. want to hear it. Yes. Tell yes. us about it. Um, it's a very vibey song. I like yeah. it because I can bump to it on my own time as well. Okay. Um, <laughs> this is one of my favorite songs that I made so far. And uh, we're just going to make better ones. I, I like what baby. you just said at 14. It's a very vibey. I'm yeah. like, okay, wait a minute. But he's like, and I can bump to my <laughs> own stuff. I know that's right. You better love yourself. Yeah. So <laughs> so, so, who worked on this with you? Chaz. Yeah. Uh, oh, in the building. What's up, Chaz? What's up, man? Uh, and, and your mama's here with you. Boy, yeah, I know hey, you're not mom. getting in no trouble. What's up, Tiny? All right, all right. How you doing? You know, I, I, I appreciated seeing you walk in the door with him. Absolutely. Because oh, yeah. it would have been easy for you to send him with somebody else. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But I like the fact that you... And I and I tell people all the time, like, yo, when when you got your youngins in this music game, it's good for the parents to be around. Protect yeah. them. Yeah, too. You know, they need a little... He need a little leadership. Why oh. yeah. he's shaking his head, no? <laughs> oh. it, 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 is, is that your most device. difficult one to deal with? <laughs> is it my... Yeah, he he's still he's still one of my sweetest children, Aww. but um he's my um he's very persistent, so he kind of he's a little nerve wracking, but he's mm. all right. That's how he get things done, though. Yeah, yeah. That's what's up, King. Very persistent. He okay, we stop. got a lot of questions for you. Oh, we do. Uh. You know, I mean, we gonna play the song. But you know, we got a lot of questions too. <laughs> we do. Because we get to, we get to see you in different, you know, on the TV side sometimes. But now you coming out on the front on your own. So we got questions. Your mama yes. just yeah. your mama just alluded to. I guess my first question <laughs> is how often do you get in trouble oh. at home? Oh my goodness. Um, it depends. Is it a weekend or? <laughs> Wait. So you have certain days that you cut up more so than other days? I no. got no. I got certain days that I um. Get like you know blamed for little stuff. Oh, so it's not oh. you. Things no. like what? Like, <laughs> like what are you getting in trouble for? Like a glass in the sink or oh. stuff like that. That's normal, mom. You know, moms do yeah. stuff like that. No, but I'm talking about call you at five o'clock in the morning to get one glass out. The <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, Tiny, is that is that right? I mean, yes, because I told him over and over again and then he just does it anyway yeah, so right. I had to make an example like no you're gonna get up and come and put it up that's put right in the that's dishwasher. what mamas do baby yes, yes. that's what mamas <laughs> do that's so King when the last time you got a whooping oh, oh um yesterday no <laughs> no nah, um, actually I don't know if it was from my mama, but that was a minute ago. That was oh, like, oh okay. years ago. Who's the strictest one in your house? Uh, on you, my father. Mm. Is he really? Yes. Like um, how? How is he strict on you? He's just. He just. He thinks so deep into things, mm. and and that gives him his answer. But he really, he sometimes overthink. Huh. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Okay, insightful one. <laughs> you got a question, Jay? I do, but it's more on the music side. So I got a chance to hear Drip already, which I love. And so you get the hip-hop side from your father, and you got the musical side from your songbird mm-hmm. mother. So are we going to see a mix of R&B and hip-hop? Because it's kind of singy. Like you said, you better sing. Mm-hmm. You will. You will. I just have to um, find the time to... Redo my singing songs. Okay. I just asked him about, like, when are you going to sing? Yeah. You know, because he has an amazing voice. I can't okay. hear. He doesn't sing a lot anymore. So I was like, uh, you still know how to sing? He's you, like, yes, you, I know how to sing. You passed the singing on down into him, huh? I, I did. I didn't know it, but he got it. Tiny, I'm going to be honest with you, because your parts in Escape, yours was always the ones that I wanted to do growing up. Uh, like, me and my sisters, when we would sing your stuff, yeah. I'm like, I'm doing Tiny's first. <laughs> well, what have your parents, what is the best advice? You just said your dad, T.I., he, he overthinks certain things. That can be a good thing, too. Yeah. What is some of the best advice that he's given you about being in the game? Um, be consistent, keep going. Um, you know, don't let nothing get in the way. Sometimes I gotta challenge him myself. Okay, you challenge your father. <laughs> I have to. On so. on what? What are the type of things <laughs> you have like, to do? Just like um, uh, I want to say the type of music I make. Oh. It's not more of what he rocks with, but. <laughs> 
You know, it's what my generation yeah. was. Yeah. I think that's so cool. You have, you're very strong willed. You know what you want to do. Despite having, you know, influences yeah. from your parents, you, you seem to have a lot of self awareness. And I think that's really dope would at such a like, young age. Would you be like, Dad, you old school? Uh, ooh, <laughs> no, you can't really. say that. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> it, 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 wait a minute. I had to go against both of them at a point. Whoa. Really? Both of them. Why? Uh huh. Well, because no, nah, you t- tell your side of the story. <laughs> well, I was, you know, I was just saying. His dad kept saying, you know, you just keep working because, and I was, I was agreeing because, you know, when, you know, when we were coming up doing our thing. It took a long time for us to really get our craft together. Right. You yeah. Know, yeah. Just, yeah. And King kind of jumped in the studio and was like, "Here, I'm ready." You know what I'm saying? And it's like yeah. you've been in. The studio two months and you want to put something out mm. like, oh, oh. Yeah. you gotta you know yeah. perfect develop. your crab, develop and so but he came up he, he finally came up with something that I felt <laughs> was um Work, you know, ready or ready, ready, and um, you know, but his dad was still was like, no, no, wait. But I was just like, he's so persistent. Let me just go ahead and do what I need to do. Let him do it. If it works, great. If it doesn't, you know, it's on him. Listen, so chill. from experience, <laughs> you, you got a little problem. This, this is the problem that you have. That song is good, mm-hmm. which means you got to come. Harder. Yeah, with the next one. And the next one and the next one. And that's what your mama's talking about being in the studio. Is that you got to keep coming back with it. Yep. I'm in the studio again today. Okay. I I was there last night. I'm going back today. And you got school today, right? Yep. So I'm I'm trying to figure out when I'm going to sleep. How do you find that balance, (laughs) young man? Uh, It's really forced on me. So, I mean, I got to go to school. Oh. Yeah. So yeah, I don't yeah. got no choice but to oh, find this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I got to find a way to squeeze it in there. Better than not squeezing it in there. So, yeah. yeah. Do you find time for fun? What do you do for fun? Um, Music is fun. Hey, I know that's right. Yeah, music is fun, but I do other things sometimes at the house. Well, like what? Like what? He uh, invites plenty of people over to the house, uh, <laughs> and that's what he gets in trouble about okay. because they leave stuff everywhere. Mm. He thinks he's supposed to have girls over, him and his friends. I mean, he thinks it's the party house. How does girls over there? Yeah, girls. Yeah, girls. Yeah, he had neighborhood girls in the neighborhood over what? there and all kinds of things. Hold, hold on, hold on. We got to take a break, <laughs> but when we come back, we're going to talk about this girl thing. Oh, yeah. Girls. So your daddy S. told me there was a problem with this girl thing and you buying too many gifts and stuff. What? But we're going to come back and oh, talk no. about this in a minute. Oh my gosh. Uncle Frank Ski going to talk to you about this. (laughs) King Harris is here. Yeah. Young King. He's hilarious. Yeah, man. Uh, We got to send a happy birthday out to your sister, man. Oh, yeah. Especially. um, I love her so much. Um, Neek, Neek. Yes, Neek, Neek. I love you so much, baby. Um, Even though you (laughs) stole my car and we was just talking about that. It's always love on this side, and me and mother love you very yes, much. Yes, Happy birthday, baby girl. So Tiny is here, King is here, and uh, King, you just alluded to something real quick. You're 14. Mm-hmm. Yes. And you already talking about a car. Oh, yes. Mm-hmm. But yeah. not just any car. Not too soon. You know, speak it into existence, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Put it out there in the universe, son. Yeah, I mean, an I-8, and um, I was going to get an I-8. The BMW That's all. I-8. A simple I-8. 80,000. Yeah. Uh... Uh, 70. 70. Okay. Oh, come on, Frank. It's 70 now. Okay. Come on. He's been going to the, he went to the uh, car lots and everything. They've been sending him emails on cars. And stuff. I'm like, why are they sending a 14 year old? Because they about know cars? I mean business. <laughs> so, how do you mean business? Who going to get this car? He's going to get it. I'm going to get it if they refusing. So, how like, you go? You got the money? He got the song Drip out now. I'm going to get it. Whose insurance wait, wait, is wait, going on? on. Wait, let's back up. How are you going to get the money? <laughs> I'm going to get it on my own. Mm-hmm. How are you going to do that? I'm going to keep releasing music. Hey. Oh, okay. Okay. And do my thing, you know? Hey. All right. Oh. So you're going to keep releasing music and do your thing and get your eye. I heard you have very expensive taste. Mm-hmm. Oh, I'm yeah, looking yeah. at your, you know, your Balenciaga, Balenciaga bag. Balenciaga bag. But I heard so that dope. you be buying gifts for girls. Uh, and I, that's a problem between you and your father. Um, yeah, he kind of, you know, you know, he kind of like a rock. <laughs> you know, like he, he, he don't care about that. I like he'll buy a girl something, but she got really mean something. Yeah, and okay. I guess, I guess he just thought that I was just doing it to do it. Ah. And I and I think that I was just doing it to do it because that girl is no longer, you know. What kind of gifts were you giving? I just bought her an outfit and like some jeans and 
two pair of shoes. Oh, oh that's all. Just the what? That's so, a lot. You don't have no girlfriend it's, right now. No. This is their first date, though. Oh my gosh. You bought a girl an outfit on her first date? Big balling. Oh, oh my <laughs> gosh. Y'all, he is so funny. Wait, you I want to adopt him. You bought the outfit for her to go out on the date? Like she had no, to come I out did. proper? No, I just we went to the mall and I just. Yeah. Okay. All, All right. right. And and in the third grade, he bought uh, a girl a, uh, a Pomeranian, a dog. A dog? For Christmas. No, he did not. In the yes, third grade. At third eight grade. years old, he bought a puppy for a, for a young girl. Yeah. Well, I had to get it for him, but um, he was like, "Look, I want to get her this dog. I want." And I'm just like, "Am I dumb self when you got it?" I always insist on paying for it myself, but they don't never let me. Mm. Yeah, he does. Okay. okay, I respect that. He does. Ching, I, I appreciate your work, work <laughs> ethic. Yeah. You know what I mean? We're going to be keeping on you. You know, we care about you. This music career, you got to... You got to go and get it. Yeah. But you got to get through school first, bro. You I got know, a couple more I know, years. I know. I you got to get through school. Your it's daddy is not going to let you leave school to do music. I don't want to leave. Just you just want to do it a different way. School. Yeah, home. homeschool. Homeschooling ain't necessarily easy. Oh, it's not. And say it was easy. It's just better when it comes to time. In the oh. balance of music. You better know, right? Nina's so impressed. She's just <laughs> nodding at everything. Because you going to school right after you get out of here, right? Yeah. Wow. And then you right. going to the studio later tonight? Yeah. And you were at the studio last night? Yeah. And now here you are this morning? Yeah. Consistent. Hustle. Right. Hustle. Hustle. King, right thank here. you for coming through yes. the morning culture, thank bro. You. Yes, yes. Um, thank y'all for having me. All right, Tiny. All right. Thank yes, you, honey. Thank you. Thank you guys again. All right, everybody. Make sure you check out the new song. It's called Drip. Drip. King Harris right yes. here in the Morning Culture on the People Station V103.